How is it growing up as like a first generation American in New Rochelle? Hmm, growing up. It was pretty, I mean, it was cool. I feel like probably in my earlier life there were more struggles, but I was young. And I think like when you're young, you <laughs> you don't really, you know, they just go over your head and you're just happy to kind of be like playing with your friends. My mom, I, I remember this. More than anything, I just remember my mother saying to me, like, remember who you are when you leave this house. That's like the major thing that like kind of like sticks in my mind when I think about my childhood is that whenever I never really got in any trouble or did anything too crazy and I felt like I was pretty focused because you know I cared for my mom so much and I saw how much she sacrificed for me that like whenever she was said that I would just kind of be like all right I got you know I had someone who I had to be accountable to like whenever I got home so I was like into art and music but I feel like those things took a back seat because when you're like a young black kid there I think now interestingly enough I think being different is more mainstream or the most mainstream than it's ever been but I feel like at a certain point in time like what it meant to be like a black kid or black man you were kind of geared towards certain directions at least when I was growing up it felt that way and like art didn't feel like a direction that I at least could go in and feel um, as supported as maybe like athletics and things like that that are more typical um, things that I guess you see from black men. So um, I kind of like shied away from art a lot when I was growing up and I played like a lot of sports, even though I love sports and I think I learned a lot from it. I was kind of like the trajectory. And then once I realized that, you know, I probably could have make a career as an athlete. It was like, all right, well, what else do I really like? And um, I don't know how it happened, but I guess like art just like was kind of what spoke to me.